All right, Shalom Akim. This is your brother Karab from GMS Miami. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Rakaha Fadash, which is to say the name of the Heavenly Father, in the name of His Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit, in the ancient Hebrew. I want to give double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone, who rule well, the top Bible teachers on the planet Earth today. And I want to give a hearty Shalom and much love to the sincere brothers throughout the four corners of the earth that push the unadulterated truth of the Bible and risk their lives doing so in efforts to waking up the whole fully lack of the nation of Israel. Shalom. Okay, and this is another quick shot of us, um, our faith boosters, you know, like, like keep it uh, uh, sweet and short, uh, straight to the point. Okay, and um, and that's really uh, like you, you see on the screen here, how, how, how you strengthen your faith. Okay, it is, uh, you know, get a heavy dose of those, those faith boosters and faith boosters can be, is, is pretty much anything, you know what I'm saying? As far as, um, uh, validating or, or, uh, you know, backing up the scriptures, you know, anything ups, downs, you know, but there, you know, there's certain things, you know, certain precepts that, you know, that resonate with brothers that they, they'll read or they'll come across, you know, that, um, that enlightens them, or no, you know, or it helps build up their faith, because, um, you know, like the scriptures say, it's a gift, a gift of hope and faith, you know. But it's our job to strengthen that man, and the only way, <laughs> the only way is to stay in these scriptures, one way or another, whether it's doing shows, uh, you know, having classes, uh, speaking on, the, on on Saturdays or whenever brothers go out, you know, all of that, all of that helps uh, build our faith, man. And we're gonna need we're gonna need a, a, a heavy dose of it, you know. And if hey, like like I said, you know, the scriptures say that it's a gift. So if um, we're doing our part, the Most High is gonna supply the rest, you know. But we just have to do our part, which is obtaining as much of it as we can. Okay. Um, yeah, I pretty much haven't uh, figured out what I would. Uh, the overtone of this one will be, but um, we're gonna go into uh, Psalms. This is uh, yeah, let's go to uh, Psalms of the Holium, the Holium 124. This is uh, Psalms 124 and one. And this is a this, you know, short and sweet chapter, but it's, 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 it's heavy, okay? It says, uh, the Song of Degrees of David, if it had not been. Uh, Yahweh, who was on our side, now may Israel say, if it had not been for uh, Salaki, if it had not been Yahweh, who was on our side when men rose up against us, then they had swallowed us up quick when their wrath was kindled against us. Verse 4, then the waters had overwhelmed us. The stream had gone over our soul. Then the proud waters had gone over our soul. Verse 6, blessed be Yahweh, who have not given us as a prey to their teeth. Our soul is escaped as a bird out of the snare of the fowler. The snare is broken and we are escaped. Our help is in the name of Yahweh by Hashem Shai, who made heaven and earth. Okay, so yeah, hey, you know, that's, that pretty much sums up <laughs> the whole Bible right there. You know what I'm saying? And that's pretty much been the... Uh, the plight of the nation of Israel, man, okay, being set up by the Lord, you know, or um, delivering us from the hands of our enemies, being led out of captivity, okay, and then coming and then finding a foundation and then, you know, going off again, okay, but guess what, we, we serve a, we serve a merciful, power, uh, merciful power, man, okay, and that's something that'll be highly, 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 highly thank of because we've all sinned and fallen short of the glory, you know, but hey, the water you have by Shimei our power is not a is not a, 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 a lying nigga that hangs at the corner store. You know, if it was, we we be out we be out of gas, man. You know, because we we we've done a, a, a plethora of things. You know, individually and as a nation, to just be ousted as a people. You know, so hey, that this is a faith booster, man. You know, you know. You know, um, it's fitting with, with the times that we're coming into, you know, it's uh, just like the scriptures say that uh, um, the devil's coming down with great wrath, you know, Revelation 12. 
And that's true, man. That's true. Okay. Why? Because it, it's it, hey. Nobody wants to be taken out of power. Okay. Pretty sure you know every time we had to fall, you know, or go under as a nation, man, it sucked. Okay. You read when you read it in the scriptures, you you can you can feel the vibration, man. Okay. And you hear the famines and things of that nature that went on. Why? Because we disobeyed our power, man. Okay. But guess what? That remnant that the scriptures always spoke of is, is rapidly returning to the Father, man. So we're looking for some great times, man. Great times. Okay? But first and foremost, we need to pray to the Lord to defend us from our enemies, man. Because that's always been the, uh, the, the monotone or the overtone. Okay? Amongst the nation of Israel. Okay, one more precept. Like I said, I'm going to make this too long. Just something nice, short, and sweet. You know? This is our... Uh, this is Isaiah chapter 29, and we'll start at, uh, yeah, we start at 7. This is Isaiah 29 and 7. It says, and the multitude of all the nations that fight against Ariel, okay, even all that fight against her, okay, and Ariel is speaking of Yashala, Israel, okay. Uh, it says, and the multitudes of all the nations that fight against Ariel, even all that fight against her and her munition and that distress her, shall be as a dream of a night vision, okay? And see, that's what we, we, we get misconstrued from time to time. You know, we, we know it, you know, but it's, uh, you know, we, we did set on, because, you know, through the spirit of power of Yahweh by Shemir al the, the major two players in this movie, okay, outside of Yahweh and Yahweh Shai are Esau, Edom, and Israel, Okay, and when, when, when we say uh, the two major players, we're, we're speaking about the elite or the elect. Okay, well, as far as speaking about Edom, the elite, okay, of their nation and of our nation, the elect of our nation. Those are the top two players. Okay. Those are the, those are the major two players in, the, in this movie. Okay. And those men, the, the elect men of the nation of Israel, that remnant are starting to wake up, man. And, and that's why you see the ball rolling and things taking place, okay? <clears throat> it says, um, mm, yeah, verse 7 again. It says, and the multitude of all the nations that fight against Ariel, even as all that fight against her and her munition, uh, and that distress her shall be as a dream of a night vision, Okay? So it's pretty much all, all the hell that we've caught as a nation is going to fade away. It's going to be like a dream, okay? All the hell that we caught and we've caught, a, a, a you know, infinity <laughs> worth of hell, man, okay? Why? Because we've been wicked. We've been off as a nation, okay? According to the scriptures, man, uh, we've been off since the Heavenly Father has known us, man, okay? So we've deserved every, every ounce of, of the, chastise, the chastisement, man, from the Heavenly Father, okay? And it says, uh, uh, verse 8, It shall be as when a hungry man dreameth, and behold, he eateth, but he awaketh, and his soul is empty. Or as when a thirsty man dreameth, and behold, he drinketh, but he awaketh, and behold, he is faint, and his soul uh, have appetite, so shall the multitude of all the nations be that fight against Mount Zion, okay? So, yeah, you know, not only is, is, is the Lord, first and foremost, open up the gates of mercy for us to find out who we are and turn back to our, you know, our, 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 our customs and our culture, you know, while we're yet in captivity, you know, which is absolutely something to marvel at, okay? Which the majority of our people don't even see, they just sweep it under the rug. You know, but that's a marvel within itself. Not only is that taking place, but also we're making our foreheads hard against our enemy, man. OK, and chanting down his kingdom. OK. And then more so than all, all those two, you know, the Lord is actually going to fight for us and, 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 and bring recompense on to all those that used us, you know, deceitfully, man, and just crushed us out. And took that crafty counsel to uh, uh, blot our names out under the sun, man. Okay? And it, which they're still doing to this day. Okay? You know? Um, yeah, none, none sweeter than recompense, man. Righteous indignation and payback for what's been done, man. 
here it is the most high took us down and stripped us as a nation okay and then the 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 you know our, our enemies which are basically all the other nations you know 